Hey y'all, we're gonna make a cheesecake tonight, a no-bake lemon cheesecake. And this recipe comes from my older sister, Deborah. Now she normally would use the lemon jello gelatin, but I ran across this Starburst lemon jello gelatin. Supposed to be new, that's what the box say. So we're gonna give this a try just to see the difference in the lemon taste maybe the same i don't know but this is what we're using the starburst lemon jello gelatin one tub of cool whip one brick of cream cheese i'm gonna add in a half a cup of condensed milk and we're just gonna throw in just a splash of lemon extract and we have um actually this is gonna be enough to do two pies so we have two graham cracker crusts already store bought and ready waiting on us. So y'all stay right there where you are. We're gonna make this pie. It won't take long. All right, we're gonna start out by mixing our cream cheese. Just until it's smooth. Adding in our condensed milk. Make sure that your cream cheese is at room temperature that way it's nice and soft you won't have to worry about any lumps and just kind of stop and just kind of scrape your bowl bring it all together i'm going to give it one more whirl Now, if you want a deeper cream cheese taste, you can use two bricks or a brick and a half. All right, that looks pretty good there. Now we're gonna add in our Jello gelatin. Now, the box say two cups, one cup of hot boiling water and a cup of cold water, but um, my sister always used just a half cup. That way it, it ensures that deep lemon flavor. So I used, um, because that box was six and a half ounce. The regular Jello box would be, I think, three ounce, yeah. So I just used um, three fourth cup of water. And I mixed it with hot water and let it cool. what you want don't panic about that smelling good already so I'm gonna add in just a little lemon extract just to kind of up that flavor and also too I took out me just a little yellow food color just to kind of tint it a little bit go overboard it is lemon right yellow okay
Oh, and I'm sorry, I forgot to also share that um, when I mixed the Jello, I did put uh, a half a cup of sugar in it. Even though the condensed milk is gonna add sweetness to it too. Okay, all right, that's a nice pastel color. All right, let's get this cool book in here. And this is pretty much it, y'all. Now, why have I been already have this open? Every time I think I'm just so prepared, y'all. myself taking it out early enough. All right, let's just kind of fold this in. Fold and mix. Take your tub out early enough, y'all. Don't do like me. I can still feel a little ice lump a little bit so i'm just going to go ahead and add the rest in and just mix it in with the mixer and this is going to go into our um store-bought graham cracker crust and it's going to freeze over it's going to sit in the refrigerator overnight the next day but if you know you want it to the same day I would suggest make it like that morning give it at least four hours to set in the refrigerator Just a little bit more color, y'all, just to give this a little bit more tint. Shells. And then we're going to see what 
what this is going to look like and taste like first thing in the morning. That's what it should look like. All right, let's go in. I'm just kind of smooth it out, level it out. Just a little bit. Oh, y'all, this is going to be so good. I can look at this and tell. I just can't wait to see the difference in the flavor of the Starburst and the regular lemon jello. All right. Let's see. Kind of come to those edges. And be nice and even. And this is what it look like. Nice and yellowy. So we're gonna put our lid on this. We're gonna top it down with the lid. Seal it down. And it's ready for the fridge, y'all. There you go. No bake, lemon cheesecake. Going into the refrigerator overnight and we're gonna cut this in the morning. So you guys, I'm glad you stuck around. I'm glad you hung out with me while we made this. It was quick, simple, and easy. Like I said, that was enough to do two pies. So y'all, try this recipe and when you do, let me know what you think about it in the comments. And again, thank you for hanging out. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for sharing my videos. And definitely hit the thumbs up on this. See y'all later. Good night. Because it's about 1030 here. Bye. We just sliced into our Starburst Lemon Cheesecake No Bake Pie, y'all. Here is the slice. Very nice. Very nice. Now, I got me just a little strawberry high filling topping to go on top of this just a little bit. All right. Look at that. All right, let's go in. that first bite that the cheese cake come through the cream cheese taste come through very nicely the lemon taste y'all it's it's kind of like a subtle mild it's it's it doesn't have that well, wait, 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 wait. Let me get another little bite first. That lemon flavor, it's, it, I'm, it's like a subtle, like lemon taste. It's not too strong, it's not too punchy, but it's, I don't know how to explain it. It's not mild, it's just right. It's, I mean, the taste is just right. 
This is really good. So you guys, try this pie. No bake, quick and simple. If you don't like lemon, just use the cream cheese and the condensed milk and the Cool Whip. But this is good. I hope you try this. And let me know what you think because this is thumbs up. So good. Bye, y'all.